Welcome to the North Gate. I'm Aitan Zakaias, and this is the channel for truth. Here, you will be learning about the Bible, the Bible in its uncut form, raw, gritty, and with no filter. So if your heart pumps Kool-Aid, this ain't the channel for you. All praises to Yahweh, Baha Shem, HaMashiach, Yahweh Shah. The One West Camp Doctrine is a cancer, led by undercover agents of the spiritual demon Satan to beguile souls into an eternity of screaming and gnashing of teeth in the bowels of the lake of fire. The top agents are easily identifiable as greedy beggars, lusting to fill their coffers, profiting from the covenants they've made with the heathen establishments such as PayPal, GoFundMe, Cash App, and Patreon, just to name a few. These camps are full of gimmicks to hoodwink the simple, such as Shalom Israel, this is Bishop Nathaniel. The Israelites have been scattered across the four corners of the earth, as prophesied in Deuteronomy the 20th chapter. Here in Israel united in Christ, we need your help to recover the remnant of our people, teach them the gospel. Please help us, support us, and join or donate to the Booster Club today. Shalom. Now, now, you want to bring out anything? I got one more scripture. Oh, yeah. Um, so, yeah, the, the, uh, your support is advancing things forward. Like, um, we 46 going to 47,000 subscribers. If, let's say, out of all those thousands, 5,000 people sincerely watch, sincerely want to learn. Those 5,000 people have subscriptions to everything. They got subscriptions to Netflix, subscriptions to uh, magazines, cable subscriptions, and you pay that monthly. Uh, $50 here. Sometimes cable as much as $150, $200 for a cable subscription. So if you watch diligently, let's say 5,000 out of the 45, 46, uh, 47,000 subscribers, you you one of those 5,000 super digilent, digilent uh uh, watchers and, and learners, then you can treat your go the, the GoFundMe donations like a subscription. Like you know what, this is I can afford to put twenty dollars in per month, just the way I put fifteen, ten, fifteen dollars for Netflix. Just like I put a hundred dollars, hundred fifty dollars for my cable subscription. You can look at it as the same thing. Uh, Five thousand people putting in ten dollars, twenty dollars a month. Uh, a month that that puts us way uh, in the place where we need. Do you know how much movement we can get if that was that case? If 5,000 out of the 46, 47,000 subscribers were to do that, it would put us way over. And like I said, can you believe you tried to compare the word of the Lord to a Netflix subscription? <laughs> That's wicked as hell. Show me one time in the Bible that the prophets or the disciples ever asked the people for money. If anything, they gave money to the people, like Paul. Listen to what Paul says, precept. 2 Corinthians chapter 11, verse 8. I robbed other churches, taking wages of them to do you service. The service of God, don't beg people for money. We give money to the people. The poor, the widow, the maimed, giving alms. Yo, you know the precepts. I'ma need you agents of Satan to stop that begging. Precept book of Ecclesiasticus, also known as Sirach, chapter 40, verse 28. My son, lead not a beggar's life, for better it is to die than to beg. And you know, the Most High is getting rid of these channels with all these clowns teaching these abominable heresies. And I can't tell you how excited I am about that. All praises to the Most High, get your wicked ass up out of here. And let me tell you something, Zion. When Judgment Day comes, what do you think you're going to get judged by? It's the only obvious answer that there is. It's the law. So wicked organizations such as IUIC, led by effeminate police officer on duty Nathaniel, HOI, led by priest Little Man Complex Sabak, IUSPK, led by General Me 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 Yohana, Sakari, led by the Gorilla Mamzia, and any other affiliates of the One West Doctrine of Satan, 
have a first class ticket to the lake of fire. And I'm gonna show you why. Now we all know that profaning the Sabbath is a death sentence under the law. Exodus 31, 14. Did you also know that it was only one people on earth that was sanctified to keep the Sabbath? So the only way a heathen is allowed to keep the Sabbath is if they belong to you as in total ownership, as in a literal slave with no rights other than what you give them, as in accordance with keeping the Passover in Exodus 12, 44. Precept, the book of Jubilees, chapter two, verse 31. And the creator of all things blessed it, but he did not sanctify all people and nations to keep Sabbath thereon. But Israel alone, them alone, he permitted to eat and drink and to keep Sabbath thereon on the earth. So with that being said, not only do these camps profane the Sabbath with these heathen in their ignorance, they also become the enemy of black women, teaching and encouraging simple Israelite men to make marriages with the Hispanic and Native American heathen. Show me one time when the Hispanics have came to support the blacks of the nation. Hell, show me one time when the Native Americans came to support the blacks as a nation. Instead, you got a pack of dodo Israelites being led by a mamzia making a spectacle of our people defending the heathen. The ignorance is astounding. The Native Americans have a number of tribes and all of them look the same. The Japanese have a number of tribes and all of them look the same. The Africans have a number of tribes and all of them look the same. See where I'm going with this Israel? So it's not rocket science that Israel looks all the same. So if you're so destitute of wisdom, and yes, I'm calling you stupid, that you think that someone that looks nothing like you is your brother, you deserve to get destroyed when the Hamashiach comes back to redeem his people. God is not the author of confusion. So the camps tell you to do the commandments, but it's all in vain because they have you worshiping around the heathen, which makes everything you do a sin. It's like Christian Church 2.0. Everybody is in but Esau, who they continually cry about every damn day. Does anyone have the preset where Hamashiach was crying about Esau? No? <laughs> I didn't think so. Get out! Get out of these wicked ass camps and don't give them a damn dime. The Hamashiach was a carpenter. He had a job. You clowns get a job and stop begging the people. Any believers in camp doctrines associated with Joseph being the father of Yahawashah, the man-made 12 tribes chart, you can marry heathens and have babies with them, or any other wild insane doctrines soaked in wickedness, you ain't making it. You going straight to the pit and good riddance. Israel, it's these clowns right here, accompanied with the rest of the obstacles that we have to overcome that's been prolonging our stay in this kingdom of oppression we get shot down in the street like dogs and give hugs to murdering heathens and think it's a good thing. I don't know about you, but I'm ready to go. So do yourself a favor and stay away from these wicked ass camps destitute of knowledge calling themselves all these different factions because we're supposed to be one as it says in John chapter 17 and 11. And before I leave, let me give you this right here, Israel. Precept. 2 Peter chapter 2, 1 through 3. But there were false prophets also among the people, even as there shall be false teachers among you, who shall privily bring in damnable heresies, 12 drop chart. even denying the Lord that bought them, saying Joseph the Father, and bring upon themselves swift destruction. And many shall follow their pernicious ways by reason of whom the way of truth shall be evil spoken of. And through covetedness shall they with feigned words make merchandise of you, whose judgment now of a long time lingereth not, and their damnation slumbereth not. Shalom. Yo fam, Shalom, Shalom, it's your brother Icon. Ah, let's get it. Man, let's get on these laws, that's the commandments, and we're trying to get a body. Man, hey.
do it. I'm gonna ride till I die or the kingdom rise. I'm trying to float up in the sky with your Howard Shah. Lord, save you for you burn them with the flames of fire. Destroy the heat in all places to the most high. I burnt my hand on the stove up in hell's kitchen. Lord, no, I know these Israelites don't listen. I'm on a mission to fight against the son of perdition. Battle wicked and the slave scoffers.